It's that time again. Morning. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's he needs a minute. And it's that place again, the Kyle family vlog. He's having a rough day. Um, this is happening. Yeah, look at that. <laughs> that is a very, very full truck. So, getting work done today. Tibbs has been struggling a little bit with, especially the past two weeks with the whole like, he wants something, he starts crying and then just cries and cries and cries and cries. And some of the time, at least, it's like, you can't have that no matter how hard you cry, so. We have our wonderful little moments that I'm sure most parents have, like right now. Sorry, buddy. We're back at Rocky Top, like always. This job is taking a long, a lot longer than we wanted it to, which means we have to, we have to run past Beverly's from yesterday, and uh, screw, uh, screw something onto a sprinkler cap real quick, um, and then. What else do we have to do? Oh, we still have to go put those fence panels back up. So we're in the process of finishing three jobs and it will probably take up the entire work day. But by the time the work day is done, we should be good. And we're taking the rest of the week off. We've got work scheduled for next week, but it's, a, it's not a light, light week, but it's not a heavy week. So looking forward to that. Look at this. We are making it through. We're trying to escape a, a, one of those Colorado hail storms that we talked about. Like, we're still getting a little bit. You can see it there. But that whole section over there up sky, that's all just hail storm. We just kind of cut the corner of it and are trying to escape before we end up in it worse. There's Sean at the window. We had to come to the regular dump today, which is always painful for my wallet because it's a lot more expensive than Rocky Top. So we'll see what today's damage is. I am placing my bets that it will hopefully be 50 or less. I was I tell Sean to get receipts because if it's like an exorbitant amount for some reason, I would need to contact the client and be like, um, you should pay some more. <laughs> What's 52. the damage? 52? I was pretty uh, close. Uh, yep. Mounting the Hello is one of the we're, cheapest upgrades you can do. Sorry. Yeah, we're <laughs> here just finishing up this stupid fence. This is the last, no, this is the second to last. The last thing we have to do should take five minutes or less, but it's across town. And after that, we have to see Sherry before we can call it a day. But then we can call it a day And in we tomorrow. don't work until next Tuesday. Oh yeah, we're taking tomorrow off. Matt and Natalie have been up in Denver gallivanting about, putting all their fun on Facebook. How dare they? Good dare for them. <laughs> but they're gonna come down here and play for a few days. What, what? I don't know what it is about this property, but every time we come here, we end up working until it's dark. And I'm vlogging in the truck and it's dark. Look at this. Look at this shiny. <laughs> I don't know if you can tell, but all of me looks like I've just been through that. I am grateful though because well, grateful, not grateful. We came back because we thought that she called us and said, oh, the sprinklers are leaking, which we had done a little thing to the sprinklers. Got here, turned them on. They were leaking, dug up the things we had done, tested them, put them back on. They were working fine. Dug some more huge leak, and it's coming from under the... Uh, the um, new concrete The new slab. concrete. So we did some more digging and found that there was a link. We were able to pull out a part of the sprinkler system from under that had a hole in it. And so I'm glad it's not because she just replaced that concrete. So she said she's not sure if they were replacing it and damaged it or if it was leaking and that's why the concrete cracked or what. But I'm just glad it's not our fault. <laughs> that's my biggest thing. I was like, okay, I just hope it's not our fault. And the puncture was like way further than we dug. And so we're like, oh, good, not our fault. We'll just refer somebody. <laughs> Hello, good morning and welcome. So, um... Today, Matt and Natalie are coming into town. They're gonna be here in like about three hours or so. So we just have a couple of short things to take care of first. But last night we got home really late. Tibbs went to bed late. Everything was late last night. So he actually slept in this morning until like almost 10.30. Yeah. Which that's the first time that he's like ever slept that long as well, a baby. He did wake up like normal, but then 
when he saw that me and Nat were not wanting to get out of bed, he finally just gave back up and went back to sleep. Yeah, he just laid back down, but what we've noticed is he's so much happier. Yeah. With the extra sleep, he like hasn't been cranky today, and usually by now, because it's almost one, usually by now he's definitely getting cranky. Hey. Yep. He's been a little joyful bundle this morning, and I, we know that we know that he gets cranky when he doesn't get enough sleep, but about three to six months ago, somewhere in there, he just started like, he doesn't want to take naps. He doesn't want to take naps. If, if he wakes up, even if he's only been asleep for five minutes, he wakes up, he's like, I'm up, I'm up, what did I miss? You ought to learn to take damn naps better. You're so much happier when you're, not, when you're properly sleeped. You want banana? Mine. Yours? <laughs> you hear him say mine? <laughs> <laughs> Matt and Natalie are in town. We just ran out and fixed something for Beverly uh, real quick that had to be taken care of right away. And uh, Matt and Natalie asked if we could meet at half four and we were like, I don't know if that's two o'clock, three o'clock, or four thirty. It's four thirty. Um, so they're gonna be here in like 45 minutes. And this is what our house looks like. So we gone by cleaning, yo. In a hurry. <laughs> yeah. Matt and Natalie are here. That's like, quick, last second, last second uh, cleaning. We just saw them drive up, but I don't know where they are now. Are you excited? Get excited. You should be excited. You're gonna make new friends. Uh, there is. <laughs> and Hectate well, is the most excited one. But it's hot. It is so hot. <laughs> it is like, oh, it is really hot. Look at this. They That's just, so perfect. They brought this London vehicle set for Tibbs. And the bus Who has is a so into vehicles right now. Tibbs? Tibbs, say thank you. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, back to you guys. As well as you have to do the stuff. Oh, what is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? Ah! Cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, that's, that's awesome. awesome. <laughs> so, I have a question, and I know that all of our American followers are going to really understand this question, so... <laughs> the question is, can you please explain to me, what does the Queen actually do? Like, right? Besides, just <laughs> besides like, I, I was here in the pictures. I don't understand besides like, the show. I don't understand it. Like, it, did she rule? What, what does she do? She, she's still head of state. Okay. Oh, okay. She's still... It's more it's the government, parliament, prime minister make decisions. They, they, oh, okay. They, they, she's still got the power. Yeah, they, they have more. They have the power. Okay. Um, so she's kind of like she, our. Yeah, they make ourselves look completely split. Yeah, it, it, it's more of a show thing. Okay. It's, it's it's nice to have still. Yeah. Okay. So how, then the next follow-up question is: How do people in like England feel about her? Like, do they? Is it just it's show for mixed. fun, or do you all it's like really love mixed, her? Mixed. Okay. You, you've, some got, you've got some royalists. Okay. Uh, which uh, the queen, this, the queen, that. Then you've got people are thinking, yeah, this royalty. It's nice to have. Okay. When we had the wedding last weekend, everyone watched it. It was nice to see. Okay. Um, but there's but, people that don't like the you know. Yeah. The, 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 it's, like it's, it's all mixed in the UK. Okay. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Yeah. I feel so much <laughs> smarter now. I've wanted to ask those questions for like. Ever. <laughs> We've just been sitting and visiting for a while and now we're on our way up to Red Rocks. And uh, you know, after all the work and stress of the past like two months, it's really nice to finally be like, oh, we don't have to do anything for a few days. We can just chill, we can visit, we can hang out with friends. I really enjoyed Eric's thing, but I uh, I didn't really get as much time there as I wanted. And so I am, I am blissfully be like, just sitting here like, okay, I don't have to work. Actually, till I think next Wednesday. I yeah. had a parking spot. <laughs> Real spat. quick, too. Couldn't decide if I was gonna say Crazy. space or spot. That's my wife. Ain't she a good looking thing in my baby right there? Mmm, gotta love them. Going up to Balancing Rock. <laughs> Tibbs is in the, the behind, not the lead. <laughs> Sky and Matt are in the lead. It's so high. High up? 
yeah, it's got a good view. We stopped at Balancing Rock for a few minutes. This little boy has just been all over the place. He is so happy to run around on these big rocks holding on to mine or his mom's hands. Like, look at that. Look at this boy. Yeah, I told you. <laughs> We're like less than five minutes away from here. It's awesome. Video games are the universal language. <laughs> Nat, tell us what you're doing in here. Hello, making tacos. Tacos, 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 fixings. And yeah, I'm about to uh, de, de skinify some avocados so we can have wow. some guacamole. Wow. wow. Yeah, I'm the best. De skinify? Uh huh. This baby is going to bed. Yes. Yeah, Bye. good night, Tibby. Goodbye. Oh, goodbye. Matt has tried tacos for the first time and they got his seal of approval. Thumbs up, yep. right? Okay. 10 out of 10. What do you think? Uh, honest, it's honest. Lovely. Good. Have you, uh, have you tried it? 9 out of 10. Huh. <laughs> I was telling them that there's been at least twice in my life that I can think of, at least in the past like two or three years, where we've been at a friend's house who have made us food and I've been like, Thanks! This tastes great! And then on the way out, I'm like, I need real food. I need something else. Like, that was really gross. So, it's always a gamble when you eat other people's food, honestly. So, they've brought us something in a bag. And he said not to peek at it when I put it in yeah, the fridge, so I didn't. Nat, yeah, did you peek? He's fine. You're a horrible person. A horrible? With the two cameras again. <laughs> yep, yep. <laughs> I think last time we we always were vlogging. Yeah. <laughs> Dunk that one and you got it. Add one. I always so, feel like a time traveler. I'll let you have that oh bag. Boy. Oh boy. Now there's a couple of things in there which you have you had before. Okay. And you've mentioned something about it in the vlog as well. Okay. okay. So I've actually bought something from America. It's been imported and they've done something with it. Yeah. Okay. Uh oh. I'm ripping the bag so I can't get it to open. <laughs> oh dear. Oh, yes! <laughs> Those Starbursts were the best thing ever. So Double decker Cadbury nougat top, crispy it. bottom, yeah, they, they and milk chocolate. Mmm! Ooh, Bounty. Hello, Bounty. Oh, yeah. Bounty. Ooh, it's a, this one's dark yeah. chocolate. Dark. Ooh, that would be good. That's just us. Oh, nerds. Nerds. That's for you, too. So yep, that's, that's a Sean that candy. Of that packet. So, can you say about the, the, get the guide on the back of the UK yeah. packets? Uh -huh. So, you can look on the back of the nerds. Yeah, I've got to stick it on through. Oh, it's got all the nutrition facts for the nerds. That's really interesting. On a box of nerds? Yeah, you usually yeah. wouldn't see that on. I mean, the American ones are too small. <laughs> May have an adverse effect on activity and attention in children. <laughs> or Sean's. <laughs> Hair drops. Ooh, a gift from Wales. Ooh. Ooh, milky bar. Wow, I think I'm like gaining weight looking at all this. Apple toffee. Oh, it's a, uh, uh, yeah, the licorice sticks. Ooh, yeah, so raspberry. Those are licorice? It, no, it's, it's like a, it's a seaside fishing in the UK. Um, mm. So it's, it's rock. Oh, stick of rock candy. Yeah. So okay. It's probably pure sugar. That's oh, so like awesome. rock candy? Yeah. yeah. Oh. oh, cool. Caramac. Nestle Caramac. I'm guessing that's caramel. After eight. These look like mints. Yeah? yeah? Oh, my oh hurt. I'm excited. Thank you. So, should we show you your Mountain Dews since we're here? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Nat, come here. Okay, you take this. Okay. And this. this. Uh. Mountain Dew Whiteout is comparable to like Fresca. Have you tried Fresca before? Oops. It's like a grapefruit sprite <laughs> type of thing. 
Uh, live wow. wire. Oh no, okay. Live wire is a bit orange. Voltage is raspberry. Voltage is Starburst flavor. Yeah. This is the ice. This is one of the new ones. It's, it just tastes like Sprite, really, but it has caffeine. And I don't I don't sugar. agree with half of her assessments of what they taste like, just, <laughs> just to be honest. So uh, you can tell us if you think she's right. Well, nobody likes you in <laughs> Throwback made with real sugar instead of corn syrup. Um, Code red is cherry. Baja blast is like a lime flavor. <laughs> what are you laughing at? <laughs> Pitch Nothing. black. Baja blast it's, is not a lime flavor. But it okay. says, do with the blast of natural and artificial tropical lime flavor. It's kind of like when you pick up a purple candy and it says grape and then you put it in your mouth and it doesn't taste anything at all like a grape. That's pretty much what pitch black is. It's like a fake grape. Um, regular <laughs> Mountain Dew. So it's quite a large so, collection then. So if you would like to, you know, stop your heart, all you have to do is drink all of them at once. <laughs> I think we're going to film a video with some of this tomorrow. Matt and Natalie just left, and we have to show you our fridge now. Oh, and Sky made me this picture as well. Oh, cute. My Zed shirt as a dress. Oh, very nice. Anyway, the fridge. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so, these are Cokes because we happen to have Cokes right now. <laughs> these are candy because they brought the, the candy. They brought us a box. And there's candy. more back there. And then those are the Mountain, Mountain Dews. Dews. So basically, our fridge is pretty much candy and soda. <laughs> I feel like a true blue American, you know? Like, if I can't get diabetes or heart disease or cancer from my home, yeah. what am I getting from my home? <laughs> <laughs> so today was really enjoyable. I, uh, we haven't met Natalie or Sky before. We only have met Matt from uh, way back if you've watched the CVX live vlog, then uh, you'll. Uh, <clears throat> if you've seen our CVX live vlog, you've seen him there. We hung out. We really liked him, and we've talked with them online and stuff. So we were we were going. We we assume we we're going to to like Natalie and Sky, but um, we found that they were very enjoyable to hang out with today. So I hope they had a good time. But Sky's we. Such a sweetie. She was like really well behaved and then at the end of the night Matt's like Sean do you think Skye's behaved appropriately <laughs> we were like um yes she's been better than my kid today <laughs> <laughs> actually Tibbs was really good today but yeah so um Matt and Natalie are both you're both noting that they're very easy to talk to we can just sit there and talk which is something that Nat and I kind of and we've we've I think we've talked about this a little bit but uh, it can be hard sometimes to make friends when you spend all your time thinking about business, being in pain, dealing with health stuff. I think that's it. That's that's my life some days. And so it's really nice when we find people we can just sit and talk to, have adult conversations with. And so I really enjoyed today and I'm looking forward to tomorrow. We're going to go do some fun stuff. So glad we're not working. We're doing fun stuff, hanging out with friends. Um, I'm happy. Right? About Can you? we just live like this forever? Live forever. You want tacos every night? I'll take tacos every night and I'll take a day off from landscaping anytime. <laughs> um, thank you for joining us today. Um, come back tomorrow if you liked it. Okay, uh, subscribe and share. Good night. If you liked it, subscribe. If you liked it, thumbs up. If you liked it, comment.